Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm here with Manuela, uh, or Manuela. I can't pronounce the name, guys, and I cannot pronounce it. The sculptor, I am sorry, I'm gonna butcher the name, so I'm not even going to try. I'm gonna put it in the description. This is such a beautiful kit, if you guys are not aware. I believe that she is currently sold out right now, and I was so lucky to get my hands on her. I moved the location to get better lighting, but it seems to be struggling to focus. I'm so sorry, you guys. I just wanted to show you this baby up close. She is available to adopt, and the hair is one of my favorites that I've done, and the fingernails, and just like all the little details are so precious. And she comes with this beautiful romper that my friend Deborah made with the matching bonnet. And look, it's little Ed Beatrix. Um, little applique here. It's so cute. It's so just well made and the fabric is gorgeous. She's so stunning, you guys. So stunning. Her little feetsies. Look, I've got <laughs> paint on me. My mess. I'm going to show you the back of the head here. She's quite heavy too, guys. She's about six pounds, which is a lot heavier than when I make most of my dolls, but I've been experimenting with some of the weight and um, six pounds is what I went with this, so she is heavy. Um, she smells wonderful, per usual, with my dolls. And she's got rooted eyelashes and um, really cute hairline here with the barely bare hair. She's got a little cut right here. I'm not sure you can see in this light, um, about right there. Just like a little scratch on her eyelid. She has a uh, slightly open mouth, so she will take a modified pacifier that she comes home with. Let me see here if I can show you the hands. So cute. I really like this, uh, this little hand here. And yeah, so she is so cute. We love her. So anyway, okay, sorry about that. <laughs> she is available to adopt over on pumpkinsparklesbabies.com. And like I said, she does come home with this beautiful bonnet and little romper. Um, birth certificate, COA, artist and sculptor COA, and I think I've already mentioned this, um, but she is, I believe her kit is sold out. I, you know, my favorite part about this doll is, is the little neck rolls. I love that. It's such a subtle little detail, um, that I think a lot of, a lot of sculptors, um, miss out on when they're making their dolls. Um, you know, you can add like belly plates and stuff like that to make them look realistic, but it's just that little neck fold that peaks underneath the romper that really makes it look extra realistic so i really am a fan of uh the sculpt and i certainly hope she finds a new mom or dad very quickly so if you're interested please go check her out on pumpkinsparklesbabies.com and i will see you guys in my next video bye